What is up everybody and welcome back to Super Mario World. I'm a little sick today so you'll have to uh, forgive my voice, it's a little scratchy. I actually didn't die on this level for once. At least on this take. This isn't that hard of a level though. One of those cave levels again. Again. I need to figure out where all the other switches are because those red little transparent square things are uh, that means that if you hit if you had hit the red switch or button, kinda like the yellow button that we hit in the first video, it means you can uh, walk up there. This is our first star power. It was great, you used to run right through enemies, it's a lot of fun. Pretty much god mode. Only thing that does can or that can kill you while you are in star in a star mode, whatever it's called, man. Where's my brain? Is uh, if you fall down a pit or something, then you'll still die, unfortunately. These spiky guys are Annoying. I hate it when you can't kill enemies just with regular fireballs or something. I, I, you might be able to kill them with a cape. I haven't tried by spinning. Yeah, see, I need to... I need to... I might get the switches sometime off video. Because then you'd be able to walk down there and stuff. It make, makes the games a lot easier sometimes. Unless you guys want to uh, see how to get them, then just leave a comment below saying if you want to see how to get them or not, then I'll include a short video with how to get all the switches. Hooray! 29 points. I think that's my best. Or tied for my best. Alright, this next level is our first water level. It's not all underwater, but a lot of it is underwater. So, I don't really like underwater levels, but whatever. You have to do them to get past, so. I think all these levels are in a cave, too, just because the vanilla, the, the vanilla dome. And my sinus is really clogged. Oh no. No. Okay. What's your favorite uh, power up? Comment below and tell me. I personally like uh, the cape a lot. If you have, it's really easy to uh, fly around and finish levels. If you pull it off right, you can finish levels super quick. And it's all, it's almost better than uh, like weapon wise. It's better than the uh, fire flower too because you just you can pretty much kill anything by spinning unless it's a ghost or something. Ooh, I hate those guys. Run. Alright, this is kind of a new environment. We haven't really done anything with ice before. You kind of slide around and stuff, as you can see. I'm not sure if you can, if there's stuff up above. Let's see if I can get enough speed to jump around up there. Let's see if I can fly up there. Ah, forget it. Forget it. Yeah, as you can see, the ice is pretty annoying. Cause you, like, Slide all over the place. Oh, come on, that's cheap. Like bats fly at you as soon as you come out of the pipe. It's not very legit. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ah, we're here, guys. 19. Yay. Get there. 
who wants to power up, I think. Or power up, I mean, uh, one up. Here's the vanilla ghost toss. Ghost toss. <laughs> These houses can be fun, but usually I kind of spend a lot of time wandering around because usually there's, it's like, almost like a puzzle. So it's kind of like, you kind of have to think outside the box to be able to finish these levels because they don't, they don't finish like normal levels. They're kind of different. Which is kind of fun. It's a little different than the regular levels, so. Those are new guys too, whatever they are. Little ghosties. Little ghost wheel too. These things could be annoying. Because that happens. Alright, we'll skip ahead to back where it was. None of that. Alright. There's a big ghost up here somewhere. It's like huge. You can do it. Yeah, there he is. It's huge. You can't kill any of these ghosts, unfortunately. I guess that would probably make it too easy if you could. Get out of here. Just fly over everybody now. Alright. Ooh, creepy. Oh, come on, I didn't even touch him. This game's cheating. Come on, wheel. Good move on. Alright, next phase. Woo. I'm not really sure what those things are. They kind of look like big, giant green bubbles, but I don't know if they're supposed to be like spotlights or what. So if you know, let me know what they are. Just comment below. Tell me. All of you Mario wizards. Yeah, they do hurt you, so you don't want to uh, hit them or anything. I don't think they bounce you or anything like that. Anything in here? Oop, yep. Pow. Pow. Coins. see. Oh, uh, yeah, see, we needed to save that pow for over there. We'll have to go through this door and do this all over again, I'm sure. Yeah, you kind of... Oh. Man, that's kind of a bad place to come out of a door. Oh, we we'll skip ahead. Back to the uh, power button here. Yeah, <clears throat> you can see what I mean when you have to think outside the box. These are kind of different from the traditional levels. They're more, more of a puzzle. Yeah, so you need to clear some of these coins out. And then hit the power button and then the blocks won't be blocking it, see? And that is the end! Hooray! No point, no extra points though. Bummer. Bummer. Alright, well, that is it for this episode. Uh, I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode.